I had to go get lunch now, I just left class, so don't know what I want to eat. Can't decide if I want pizza or McDonald's. I got my next class at 12. Still haven't finished my drawing for that class, so. It's gonna be a long day. Just trying to get through it. Aunt Joseph, around hella thugs. Covenory and lamb's wool. We surrounded by the fucking wolves. What if me? Finally back at the condo. Almost. It's been a long day. I fell asleep on the train three or four times. Kind of pissed. My freaking headphones short circuited, so only one works now. So now I gotta go buy a brand new pair of headphones. Really just thinking about getting Bluetooth because I'm sick of the bull crap with them. So, anyways. Got Jimmy John's actually waiting for me tonight, so I'm pretty excited about that. Anyways, I got no so I'll talk to you guys later. So, head to the gym. Uh, kind of mad because I really don't have any headphones that are like earbuds besides the Apple headphones. And, uh, I honestly really could care less about apple headphones like i wear them i used to wear them so much that like after a while like they make my ears kind of sore and they hurt so plus i like more noise canceling headphones i just need to like really invest in a pair of the like earbuds that are the bluetooth beats but i ain't got 200 dollars right now so yeah Anyway, head to the gym right now. Uh, my dad went there earlier, and I guess last night my buddy told him or I instant or messaged him on Instagram and uh, asked if it was closed because my dad went by earlier, and uh, I guess it like was closed this morning, so he went by a little or, or a little later on, and their power was out. But I guess they fixed it, so I'm gonna head to the gym now. Um, I did a little bit of recording today. I mean, a little bit more of me like traveling around, but uh, not as much as I hope to. I guess I'm just kind of trying to get over like the awkward feeling of like walking and talking to a phone and talking about what I'm doing and having people look at me. So I'm trying to get over that little like awkward phase, I guess. Like I said, I need to get my camera charged. I still haven't found a charger. If anything, I might just go out and buy one if I can get a hold of one. But I'm a little on the broke side. My hours have been cut back at work. And I've also been taking off like every couple weekends because I want to go home. And those are taking a toll on me. So, And also with like my grandpa was uh, diagnosed with colon cancer about a month ago. So he's been going through a lot lately. So I've also been going home a lot to like see him when I can because he also has a bad heart condition too so like he has a pacemaker and he's having to keep getting it readjusted and he's they keep having to delay his chemo so uh yeah I think it's it sucks and then so I've like been going home as much as I can just because just in case like something happens and I mean like I don't want to think about the worst things but yeah you know if you ever lost somebody in your family that's very close to you, and my grandpa's very close to me, so, and, so like I said, it's been, uh, everything's been rough lately, so yeah, uh, like I said, I'm going to the gym now, um, I need to hang out for all day tomorrow, do whatever, sounds like my mom, my sister might actually come, so I finally will get to bring my big ass TV here, I got a new TV, I haven't, I don't know if I told you guys about that yet, but, um, uh, my mom was doing an estate sale for these people. Short or long story short, my mom was doing an estate sale for these people. The guy was like had like two homes or whatever, and he was like a millionaire or whatever. So the guys that were she was helping like said, "Oh yeah, if you find anything interesting that you want in the house, we'll give you a good offer." So she found this TV. It was a 50 inch TV, it was like six months old, and they were selling it for like 200 or something. And the, and she I get she got an offer. She asked them, was like, oh, hey, if I gave you a hundred bucks, would you be okay with that? And they said, yeah. 
So I ended up having to actually only spend 50 since my mom borrowed some like money from me, so she ended up paying for that. So I really, I only paid like 50 bucks for it, if that. So anyways, but it's been stuck in Michigan because I haven't, every time I go home now, I've been taking the train, so I haven't had a car to drive back with it. And obviously I can't take a 50 inch TV on the train with me, so hopefully I'll be getting that finally in my condo this weekend because I'm sick of my little TV I had there, but my bigger one. So, like I said, hopefully everything works out and they come and I'll get my TV. Anyways, I'm going to head out for now, so peace out. Hopefully I'll record some more before I go to bed tonight.